on Josh Fuller. I had uh, originally thought of asking uh, about uh, the, the fun police and pushing <laughs> back on the boombox and allowing us to screech at people with goats again. But uh, after seeing Optimus, I was inspired to ask, uh, does, has anybody asked Optimus's opinion of, of Mars? And <laughs> does he have a ticket yet? Uh, well, you know, Optimus is not uh, a deep thinker at this point. Um, so uh, Optimus is uh, still, you know, figuring out how to do basic stuff. Um, like, it, like it, it, it couldn't make, uh, you know, cook some eggs or something quite yet. Um, it, it, so we need to get Optimus to the point where uh, it has um, reasonable ag agility and can, and can do basic things. Um, and, um, you know, and we're aiming for it to, to start off doing simple tasks that are sort of boring and re repetitive um, or, some, or dangerous, uh, basically jobs people don't want to do. <laughs> so that, that's, our, that's our goal, uh, it, and, and um, I'm confident we'll, we'll achieve that goal. Um, and then uh, we've we got to figure out how to make it at scale, make sure that the, robots, the robot is safe. Um, I think it's going to be very important to have um, a local means of turning it off. Um, <laughs> so safety is going to safety is going to be extremely important. Um, I can't emphasize that enough. Um, but but right now uh, it it is not at an intelligence level where it's pondering uh, questions like Mars. Um, but perhaps it will be one day. So. Hi. Good afternoon, Elon. My name is Luke Arsenal. Uh, I just want to start off by saying a big thank you to you and the team of Tesla for all you guys do. Um, it's been great to see, and I'm, I'm so happy for you guys. My question is, with the rise in cybersecurity threats to operational technology and the Internet of Things, what steps is Tesla taking to protect the company itself and its products from these threats? Also, as a suggestion, because I know you like suggestions, for the navigation, do you think we could do something on the UI that adds in when you're about to take the off-ramp to show a picture of that exit? kind of like other map systems do. Um, and then also... Oh, my, man, this is a lot of questions. <laughs> one of my friends wanted to get a shotgun from you, if that's possible. Okay. Um, well, we are, we are constantly improving the navigation system. Um, and uh, uh, being robust to hacking is incredibly important. Uh, in fact, we um, uh, conduct a lot of sort of uh, third-party hacking uh, con contests to... Uh, try to get the, the best hackers in the world to break into our cars. Um, and actually, no one has yet actually broken into a, a, a Tesla in a way that would allow you to really control the car in a significant way. But they have gotten to where they can like honk the horn and mess with the infotainment system. Um, and I'd like to thank them for their efforts. <laughs> um, so we, we take information security uh, extremely seriously. Um, for navigation, um, yeah, there's, there's definitely things we can improve there, uh, but really, uh, down the road, navigation uh, visuals are not going to matter very much because the car is going to take you wherever you want to go. Um, yeah, uh, for, as for pictures, I, 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 have to, I have to decline, unfortunately, because otherwise, if, if I say, I, I, hate being, I actually hate being rude to people, so if, if I say yes to one person, then it's, it's, it's like selfies for a zillion uh, you know, it gets kind of gets kind of crazy. So, um, but uh, thanks for asking me.